pretty confident. I, I, one thing's for sure is that um, with Yadiel and Butters, they're really good uh, players mm -hmm. with their characters. They understand what they're doing with their characters. Uh, they really try to make it work with whatever tools that they have. Um, especially yeah, yeah, like, like we were seeing. He's just saying hi to at home. Oh. Chad, say what up to Yadriel, man. Give him his props. All right, so we got a button check. You know, we're chilling right now. That's what I'm talking about. The stand in place button check. Make sure everything works. That's it. See, I don't let people do combos on me on button checks. You're trolling. Back up. There's a button check, not a combo check. Yeah, nah. Come on, man. See, nah, I wouldn't let him do that. You know he's godlike. You got those links, just do it in the match. But it's all good. My man's got the sus earrings. Ooh, wait. You see him? Butters being sus. Yeah, instantly. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear the Puerto Rican crowd of course, already yeah. yelling. That's the iconic. Yeah, here. free. Any any island community, like, you will always hear the support for each other. I love it. Passion over everything. This is a good outfit for casting. And Kodal, too. Hello. Yeah, anything but the, the stupid haircut and the Mass Effect skins. <laughs> Terrible. Anyway, back dash, going to slow it up. The one thing Kotal does lose relative access to in this game is the parry of projectiles because Cassie's straight gunshot is two bullets. So he'll absorb one and get hit by the other one. But instead, he elects to go for a tick throw instantly to show Butter Punch that the mind games are early and immediately launches a damage totem. One thing to note too is that Yadio usually runs the totem. And now, and not to say that it's not a bad uh, setup for custom moves, it is just not something you see a lot when it comes to Kodo's uh, more common uh, variation. All right, gonna hit confirm it this time and get the launch. Go for the down two. Oh! oh! Left the bot on the screen because you're a bot. <laughs> he got hit with the smoke bomb into death. That was a sick first round. An another one! What? Actual bot. Oh! Oh, you're <laughs> oh my god! That's half of her health. Cassie, please! Oh and then the god. command grab. Everything is working for Yadriel right now. We're looking close to a 30 second round. Oh, <laughs> Wait, nah, stop it. I don't want to talk anymore. You got it. Okay, didn't have amps to keep it. Okay, the E. <laughs> the me actually checking Yadiel. This is going crazy. Yeah, yeah, I, I understand. <laughs> Trust me, I've been there and it just happens. Get the punish on the short hop. Those aren't necessarily the strongest moves in an offline setting. And let's not sleep. Butter Very Punch nice coming ball. back from the depths oh of hell. My God. And it's going to do a lot of damage. So not enough to obviously kill, kill. but puts them in a position where the next BNB does. However, Yadriel does have access. No, he doesn't. If he gets opened up here, he dies. Oh. But the forward two right on the glasses. What could have been a choke, a micro step back, and a whiff punish would have spelled curtains. But what an exciting game one. I think we're going back to character select. It seems that we are. That was a really good. I like the attempt from Butters. Let's be honest here. That was a really, really. Uh, like any other player would have instantly just clocked out as soon as that health got closer, but mm -hmm. Butters really tried to keep it together. And there's the Puerto Rican flag running through. Oh, of course, baby. You, you can't travel and without no, the flag. Makes, no, it makes you me can't so travel happy. without the flag. Just, again, just seeing my island just like going through. Butters thinking here. Definitely really considering. Like I mentioned, has the potential to keep. Uh, his mind cool and collected. Mm -hmm. Probably just taking a moment to just analyze what happened and how Johnny best to change. approach it using the Johnny this time. I do agree with the change, not to say that he wasn't doing bad with uh, Cassie, but at least he has the regular health, doesn't have to worry about 950, mm -hmm. and has a little bit more to work with in regards to some of the like footsies that Johnny has. Should be exciting enough. Keeping it in the family, by the way. He knows exactly what he's looking for. Yadriel, not shook, not moved at all. Minding his business. Let's get in the game, too. Okay, don't press. Yeah. Oh, hello. Big oh. whiff right there. And the good call on the back roll, thinking Johnny was going to follow up. And right back at you. Here's a forward roll. Anything you can do, I'm right behind you. I'm not necessarily going to say better because he lost. But, all right, we got the outtake fireballs just on the button. And Yajadel is so good in his placement of the forward two. It's always at the perfect spacing and distance. Now that's stand four, he was trolling right there. But he gets the clean jump in into the fatal blow. I don't know how much this does with the jump in. Seeing a lot of shields, so it's definitely not gonna kill, but does it put him in a situation where sunlight becomes checkmate? Right. Not quite. Yeah, definitely Butters has a uh, still a bit of health to work with. 
Yad Yel, um, no longer having access to Fatal Blow. So it can also be that... Oh, no, didn't cancel the Fatal Blow. Drop the cancel. Second time we've seen it today. That has costed Nerves, every baby. Yeah. Offline. Ooh, -wee. my man is sitting right next to him with the crowd chanting against him and playing on stream. Oh, yeah, that, that, that's a that's a three-headed monster. All right, no flawless black there, so that string is going to go safe. Down four into the guaranteed unblockable on hit again. Nice punish. This time amplifies it because the damage totem is up. Yeah, Butters needing to get some form of momentum here. Hopefully this throw can help it. Nope, just carry the projectile. It's all good from Yadian. Yeah, he remembered that he could do that. Nice sure, huh? mix up there. He's looking for the stand too, even though the low is relatively slower after that. Still got opened up and the classic regular string. Nothing special, nothing fancy. Not going to open up the door for a comeback because as we know, Johnny Cage touches you with that fatal blow. You're looking at a 50 to 60% combo depending on the situation. We are going back to character select. This is one, potentially one last chance. Actually, no, it would be one last chance for Butters to mm -hmm. go back, um, considering that if Butters does win the game, he would have to stay the new character. Um, but let's see what potentially can happen here. Uh, there was just no chance for him to start up the footsie game with Johnny, not even a projectile game. Just Yadiel was literally keeping Butters in the corner, if not catching Butters with some of the most far out moves and Butters just not reacting. All right, is this three tries and three characters? It is gonna move over to the uh, CEO home, the Joker, just making his sixth or seventh appearance, whatever it is at this point. Gonna fumble around with the customization, but just gonna take his time and, and, and dial back on a breather. Very underrated tactic in a tournament setting. Get out of your own head, be nicer to yourself, yes. and allow yourself the space to breathe. Too much of the uh, pressure on you or putting yourself through pressure can definitely change up a lot. So always taking that minute to breathe is really important as a player. Again, not quite. Going to keep it safe this time. All right, his Joker can't really punish that. Got to hold that right now. Playing the long game. 99 seconds. All right, 20 of them are gone. And we've oh. only lost about 20% health each. Nice, actually interrupting this Ooh. time. And that is exactly what Butters needs to be doing off of that string. Slow it down, no rush. All right, it's going to get a free damage totem out. Oh, excuse me, he what? went right under the startup. It's just a very unfortunate situation there. Nothing too funky except the trajectory of that Jack in the Box clown. Plus, that is guaranteed. You got to hold that. Another block string, keeping it safe. And, and ah. Ooh, okay, that was punish. actually a really scary yes. there. But now, good punish to get the amp. And that's the second one to load the crushing blow. Mm -hmm. Needs one more to get it. Okay, shots coming in handy. And yo, Butter Punch showing the versatility in his gameplay. Able to slow it down and be as disciplined as possible. Yeah, Jadiel trying to steal a turn, trying to steal another one. He's gonna, oh! Ex nah, you're random. You're random. My man did reversal command grab. So if you did anything but jack in the box, oh, it's time. 18 seconds left. He wants to win this round. He said, you know what, yo? I don't rely on Fatal Blow. I'm actually godlike in this game. So hold that. Here's the life lead. Sunlight incoming. And now Butter Punch has all the pressure to make the move on. Oh, OK. That was a little bit risky on Yad Yad Yad's Yeah, he, part. Looked for, he was looking for a micro duck. I, he was, yeah, yeah, he, he was trolling. I was definitely expecting the micro duck or at least something to really get the sunlight because that would have been a checkmate situation. Mm -hmm. However, I do also agree that still the fatal blow was a good choice. You don't really need to use it for comeback unless you're trying to get just damage. All right, damage totem up. Goes for the full, screen, uh, full string. No flawless block again. So Yad Yad mixing it up, knowing that he hasn't been punished for, for anything that he's essentially given away at this point, but it's also conditioning because if you cancel strings of the disc, eventually your opponent is fine with just taking the block and getting the pushback. Nice tick, gonna take some more of this blood. I don't know if that's the type of blood you want to ingest, dog, but it might make you crazy enough to just win the tournament for free with no disregard for all the bodies left Whoa. in his wake. And Yadiel, potential set point here. Final round, fight. Butters, though, has been making the changes just needs to keep it clean. Oh, but that trade happens off of the Batman projectile. Mm. Keeps it clean. 240% nice form of damage off of a two-hit string into a special move. Very, very efficient Kotal Khan is. Oh, no. Oh, 
Raw overhand. I, I understand. Wait a minute. <laughs> Opportunity strikes. Knock, knock. Not the biggest combo he could go for. Definitely feels like a lot of pressure. Nice stagger forward two, keeps it safe, clean, and guaranteed. Back to back. One more opportunity. Oh, oh no! Why not well, Fatal Blow cancel? I think the nerves are just there for Butters and might, that might actually have costed him. And right there, Butters going down with Yael. Yo, I don't even want on. to see the number on that damage. That was three stack totem, and he, he got the full cut into Fatality. Yeah, it's time.